Turku is participating eccentric because of the growth rate. We are growing inside the city. The urban sprawl is history at the moment and there is more and more lack of space in city center. So we need new solutions in traffic and mobility. A vital part of Turku becoming a sustainable city is that the citizens really consider their travel behavior. This means how do they reach different destinations that are, for example, less than three kilometers? Is it really necessary to go by car or could it be other means of transportation? We are at the moment at the Kupita area, which is the laboratory focus area of the Civitas Eccentric project. It's an uh, area with lots of companies, students and citizens. We are planning to create a mobility node in Kupitta area that will combine several modes of transportation. Uh, in 2029 Turku is celebrating its uh, 800th anniversary and at that time we are eager to be on the road to carbon neutrality uh, before 2040. Uh, the most promising projects to lead uh, to a sustainable city are mass projects uh, as well as uh, electrical buses or biogas transportation as well as uh, making uh, winter biking more popular. The key word is uh, mobility change. Uh, using more and more bicycles uh, leaves space for other activities in the city so they, uh, they might be the solution through the year to make uh, make uh, city more livable and, and mobility more sustainable. Uh, the electrical bus project is a project to electrify one of the main lines in the city of Turku. Uh, we will get six uh, fully electrified buses and two opportunity charge points to the line one. The long-term vision with the electric buses is that hopefully the half of the fleet could be electrified before 2025. The city of Turku is, is working with the mass services on, on the different uh, levels. First we are uh, cooperating with the five different partners for the service side and then we are making lots of work on the IT sector 